I'm out here grinding today. Uh, when this get uploaded, it should be like three, four weeks apart. But this is episode five. Yeah, five of Death Note. Got my handy Danny notebook. If you don't know what that reference is from, you need to start watching so many goddamn animes. Just saying. Death Note episode five. Last week, the episode four. Uh, the last five minutes, I like mean, that guys took the bus and did all that. That was pretty damn interesting. I would, I would want to know. Also, what I said last week and what I'm going to say this week. Like, if you kill Ray, man, you fucked up. You had a good redeeming character uh, last episode. Then you're going to fuck it up. But this guy just trying to do his job. He might be an FBI. He might be watching you. But he had one day left on his job. Like, come on. He better be tall. He about to be tired, he was about to leave like alone, but please, unless Ray did something very bad that I don't know, I'm gonna be very sad. Let's go into the video. Anyway, I don't want the police to know that I've come into contact with an FBI agent either. If my father ever found out, there's no doubt he'd let him know. I think it's kind of like happened here. So you were already riding the bus when the hijacker got on? Yeah. And in the end, the guy freaked out, jumped off the bus, and got hit by a car. Did he die? Yeah, probably. I couldn't really stick around to see what happened to him. You know, hmm? it's a little hard to believe that that was all a coincidence, don't you think? What do you mean? Think about it. You got on that bus because you were investigating someone, right? And now you're telling me that this criminal is most likely dead. Doesn't that suggest that you... That's enough. <laughs> Look, darling, you and I know you used to be one of the best agents in the FBI, but now you're my fiancé now. We, we talked about this. You're not an agent anymore, so just leave it alone. But... Okay. He is, you he is wouldn't get involved help. with the Kira case, and you wouldn't do anything dangerous. That's what you promised when we decided you'd come with me so I could meet your parents in Japan. You do remember that, don't you? Yes. You're about to write down the name of that agent, aren't you? The one from the bus. Not yet. I'm gonna wait one week before writing his name that way. In the meantime, I think I'll use some of those inmates I've been keeping alive to play around with Elle a little more. Elle. Hmm? Another victim. This one left what appears to be a suicide note. Gods of death. Elle, do you know? Gods of death. Is he trying to tell us that gods of death exist? I've been using known criminals who live in this part of town to test out different killing methods, and I've learned a lot about the death note. Oh, For example, if I write a cause of death and the circumstances leading up to it, I can add a name afterwards, and it'll still happen. Ooh, even I didn't know that one. He's here. You should be God. You should know. Right on time. Mr. Ray Penber. Turn around and you're dead. I am Kira. Shop? That's right, the one sweeping the floor. I'm gonna kill him just for you. But, but how? Don't do it. Well, that man has been repeatedly charged with sexual assault. He's managed to avoid ah, conviction fun. every time due to the fucking kill the little way part of the foul foul. Man, this fucking music is like Game of Thrones when Sorcery comes out. Fuck. I can't kill someone who I haven't seen. I have to know their face. Which I want the files containing the identities of all the FBI agents who came to Japan. I do have my laptop with me. It's the one I use for work, but I don't have the files you're looking for. Now, I'm going to ask you something. If I have even the slightest suspicion that you're not being honest, your girlfriend is as good as dead. How many FBI agents are currently in Japan? Speak quietly into the transceiver and don't make it obvious. I believe it's four teams. Three agents per team for a total of 12. Of those 12 agents you mentioned, I want you to write down the name of your superior, the one who's heading up this investigation in the space at the very top of the page. What is the meaning of this? What is he after? Let's face it, he hasn't really left me any choice. Besides, it's not like he can kill them using just their names. Next, take out your laptop and turn it on. Good. Looks 
looks like you're done. Now put the transceiver and all the papers back into the original envelope and place them on the rack directly above your head. After that, you're going to stay in your seat and ride the train for at least another 30 minutes. When you are absolutely certain that nobody will notice you leaving without the envelope, you can get off the train. Kira, who are you? actually signing like a death, death wound for all of his colleagues. As for Penber's boss, he died of a heart attack after sending all of his agents a file. According to him, it seems that you arranged for the FBI to come to Japan and investigate everyone here associated with the task force. Yes, I did. So how do you explain this? Are we now suspects in our own investigation? I felt that it was necessary to uncover Kira's identity. More importantly, Kira killed those FBI agents, didn't he? It's obvious he'll kill anyone who gets in his way, whether they're criminals or not. So he might as well tell me now. I don't want you to be alarmed. I'm sure you've heard of this Kira investigation. Well, I'm currently in charge of it. What? Are you serious? That's totally awesome, Dad. You're the best cop ever! That's not quite the point I'm trying to make. Died yesterday. Does that mean they were all killed by Kira? What? What I'm saying is there's a chance that Kira will actually try to kill anyone who comes after him. His crimes are ruthless and more frightening than anything we've seen. Many detectives have already quit. Dad, you should quit too. I don't want you to die. What if he gets you? I think it's honorable of you, Dad. I'm proud to be able to call you my father. And if anything should ever happen to you, I'm going to find Kira and make sure he gets executed. to leave this investigation. Now is the time. I'm not that You'll be demoted if you choose not to stay. You have my word. But if you're not absolutely sure, then we don't need you. You have to be willing to fight against him, even if that means making the ultimate sacrifice. There's no doubt about it. I remember him because he told us to get down. But I don't really remember any of the other passengers. I see. Well, thanks for talking with me anyway. I appreciate it. Now. Five oh, men below. below. Well, six, including myself. Still, I'm grateful to see that there are as many as five of you willing Looks to risk your like lives to face evil. God, thank the fact that you've chosen to stay I'll means you have a strong sense of justice. I trust all of you. L, if all of us are going to work together on this investigation, and if you truly meant what you said about trusting the six of us, could you come here so we can all meet in person? The thought had already crossed my mind. I'm staying in a suite at the Tato Hotel at the moment, but I'll be switching hotels every few days from this point on. Kira, it seems we're getting closer to each other in equal steps. It's only a matter of time before we collide. So be it. I'm ready to show my face. I'll make my first public appearance as L. If you ever managed to find out about these secret meetings, I'm sure you'd feel compelled to move in. That's what I'm counting on. There are endless possibilities. The real battle is only just beginning. This was a good episode. Uh... A little bit of a cool down from the last episode, but still was a good episode nonetheless. He killed Ray. Killed him. I knew you were about to, but... One of my favorite castles. He's gone. He's gone. Now, I do like the castle, but I get why I like how to do it. Uh, 
I really do enjoy his ball so much. I don't know why. Uh, the, the, they said this episode too, he's a chef, basically. And I like his chef. He calls him out the chef and basically his deputy uh, uh, guy with him. I worked down last couple episodes. Miss Shuda. Basically, I like both of them too, the way they, that chemistry to go. feels like. I'm trying to think of that guy name for Batman. Basically, basically, that show. Is it Harvey Dent? No, I don't know Harvey Dent. I can't think. I think I can't think of his name, but that's who he reminds me of. Uh, this episode, I wrote down two things. I remember here on the last episode. Or this episode, two death notes. What does that make? Like, I was, when I heard about it, I like, I like, like, wait a minute. Does uh, L do he got one of the death notes? Because it say he got two fucking death notes, so it a uh, possibility. But watching the series, it don't seem like like got not like L got one. But I don't really know. But right now, uh, like who who can you say is this bad guy on the show? They both say they want justice, but which one are they speaking the truth? Like. I'm, I think L gonna change in a couple more episodes, in my opinion. Like, he might turn to the bad guy somehow. Like, you can't, you can't really say light is the bad guy, because you want to kill the bad people, but people getting close to him, so you kind of do got to kill, kill them, but... I don't know, man. This series got me in so many emotions right now. I done did three episodes tonight. Probably about the next one. The next one. I do not give a fuck, I ain't got nothing else to do, it's my day off, hopefully I don't get fouled on my day off, and y'all don't know that reference, you can go fuck off too. Uh, thanks for watching the video, please check out the Patreon if you got time, and this show can be kind of two times a week if you want, I don't know how many I'm going to film tonight, but if we get like enough donations, this will become a two times a week if y'all want it to. Thanks for watching the video, please leave a like and comment. Subscribe for more content. Peace.